Hey YouTube, what's up? This is the Fat Vegetarian here. Today we're going to be playing a chapter of Zen and Interloper. I'm uh, excited to go. Zen is one of the scariest parts of the game, but one of my favorites. Um, we are almost done. So for those of you who are like, oh, why isn't the game done? It'll be done soon. Crouch jump. Jump crouch. I actually was a crouch jump. Go quick. Ow. Jump crouch. Crouch jump. Whatever. Bye bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. Yeah, he just disappeared into the void of space. That's fun. Yes. You know this. My reloading sound is glitched. <laughs> this game has some of the best parkour elements I've never mastered. Okay, we're back here again. You didn't fall. Off that. That's okay. Jump. Jump, jump. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Again? No, why? Bye. Trying again. Okay. I wasn't sure if he died or not. Optimum position achieved. Nope. You know, last time I played this, who knows how long ago. Um. The loading sound is totally broken. There we go. I didn't have this much of a problem. Oh. Um. Yeah. These are really cool towers. They're kind of creepy, though. They look like bone or like a spine or something. You know, I've noticed that older games are kind of scarier than newer games, just in the fa in the way that you don't know for a fact what anything's supposed to be. You just kind of have to guess at it sometimes. Um, you know, because they don't have crazy high depth, uh, high, high depth. High depth. <laughs> Johnny Depp. They don't have crazy high depth definition um, textures, so you have to. Ow! What the? Not cool. You were sleeping. I kind of that you were dead. Oh, crud. What the? Oh, oh no! <laughs> uh. anymore. Oh my gosh, that was... Ah! Nope. Nope, nope. You know, if I was actually Gordon Freeman, there would be no hope for humanity or any... Nope. Yeah, that's really hard to do. You have to jump, you have to crouch, and then jump. Nope, see, I did it again. Ah! Maybe I should wait for it to get just a little bit closer. Crouch jump! There we go. Nope, I didn't. I still didn't. Come on! That guy over there, he's almost falling out. See, I was not the first one here. Kind of curious as to how many. Let's, let's count the dead guys. So, so there's, there's one. We'll count the dead guys as we go. As I, as I see him. Oh, shoot. There's two. <laughs> Valve is such a troll. They're like, <laughs> let's do this. Yeah, and I know we can. One dead guy. Ah, ah, ah. Ooh, dead get No, just kidding. Just the one. Jump! Yeah! Okay. Whoa. Valve, why? Valve makes really interesting stuff, and I think that Zen is probably one of the scariest environments uh, I know I've ever played on. In my my opinion. Okay. You're not actually dead. Now you are. Oh, man, you just float. Ow! What the heck are you doing? Maybe there's like, I know there's supposed to be low gravity, but I don't think it's supposed to be anti-gravity. Oh, did I scare you? I'm sorry. What if I can destroy this? Here, have a rocket! 
You can! It can be done! If I do it, they will die. Okay. Really? Bro. What do I do? Just... Take the to do it? Oh, crap. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to. There we go. Well, they pretty well cooked, uh... Oh, two dead guys. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so this thing heals you. That's good. Magical blue water of magical blueness. I don't want to know why it glows. I mean, I do, but I don't. It's one of the things that you just don't ask after a while. Why does this happen? I don't know. Where do babies come from? Well, you see, son, the stork has a very, very busy business. Get him on mail order. Babies come in neat little packages from Sears. Can I get inside this? I can! Hi, flying diamonds. Um, oh, there we go. It's been a while. They remind me of uh, Skylons from a uh, oh, what's the TV show called? Land of the Lost. Show from the 80s. And there were these things that flew around and controlled the weather or whatnot. I don't remember? It's been a long time. <laughs> Get it controlled. Okay, sorry. Spins and shoots lasers. Ah, whoa. Okay, sorry, I didn't mean to do it. I'm sorry. 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 Just throws around. Like teeth. Oh, crud, they're growing. I'm out. Bye, guys. Bye. I can't win. Okay, Mr. Sir, wherever you may be. Hey, look! Three dead guy! <laughs> what on earth? Oh! <laughs> I forgot that that's what that was. Head crabs. Ow! Oh, look, broken textures. Lovely. Someone tells me not to get hit by that. Oh, I'm totally out of stuff. Okay, well, here. Ah! How the heck am I supposed to kill those? Baby head crabs? Oh, crud. Normal head crabs can be hard enough to hit, but I don't need more little ones. Like listening to somebody drink. Ugh, I hate that sound. People do this all the time. Ugh, it's like right in your face. Everybody does it, so I mean, it's not like. I feel like you're supposed to be moving around more. Okay, yeah, okay. Maybe head crabs, is that what you're supposed to be? That little thing on there like that. Go <laughs> away! Oh my gosh. Just gross. This is what headcrabs are supposed to be. I don't want to let headcrabs go on my lawn. Um speaking of headcrabs, um, this thing. Um in Half-Life 2 they were going to have one. Um, it, uh, it wouldn't look like this. It was strapped up to a machine, and that's how they got all the head crabs in those games. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, look! Four dead scientists! <laughs> I think. Yeah, we're on four. Scientist dead guy number the fourth. Ah! Can I walk on this? Probably not. It's best if I... Let's just not say I didn't. Oh, 
my shotgun ammo on this. Ow! Oh, look a hole. That pump was not very smart. Start pouring head crabs down on me or something. Oh, it, it's like, ah! Minor lacerations detected. Okay. More magical blue water. I'm out of ammo. Uh, here. This thing. This takes forever. Oh, dude, my hand. My hand looks very, very poorly lit. <laughs> okay. Sorry, that's really well animated water, by the way. Anybody from Valve, or who can talk to Valve, which is nobody, watches this. I, will, I congratulate you on your water skills. Five dead scientists. Okay, I can get into that one safely. Is the bias bot, 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 boss fight still going on? Because I don't hear any. Yep, it's still there. Just keep looking at it. Hi. Bye. Hi. Five dead scientists. What are, what are these things anyway? It's like, is it, does it exist solely for the purpose of blowing things around, or like... <laughs> jump pads are gross. The thing about Zen always grossed me out. It's like, what is this stuff, you know? See, that's why I have to stay away from it. That's why it's dangerous. It breaks the textures. <laughs> Not because it does anything, not because it's poison, it breaks the textures. Nope. Well, there's, they're everywhere. Oh, wah! Yeah. Throw a grenade. And it even re it reacts to the physics and stuff. That's, I do have to admit that is kind of neat. Nope. Uh, I was recently playing through uh, Half-Life Uplink. Uh, not Uplink, the hacking game. Half-Life Uplink, the, the, uh, the demo for that was originally handed out at, uh, like, GameStop. Oh, man, it hurt. Oh, shoot! Uh, this one. Uh, but yeah, there's a demo that they would give out at, um, GameStop or Blockbuster. I don't know what was around in 98. I was born then, but I don't remember. Um, but yeah, they would give it out to people to try the game out so they could brag about their engine, uh, you know, whatever game stuff they do. And, uh, so, the, oh, yeah, red. There's not a, you can't go on Steam and, you know, get it or whatever, for whatever reason, which I think is kind of weird. I mean, if you, the company that invented Half-Life, you know, you'd think that maybe you'd have a, a demo to one of the best games that you've ever made. Readily available. But I, no, I had to download. I had to download it as a mod. Come at me, bro! Just sit there and whine. Um, no, I had to download it as a mod, and I installed it. It's pretty short, although I, I think it's a lot creepier than. Uh, I'm making it move, I'm doing something right! I, I personally find it a lot creepier than the actual game, just some of the stuff that happens. <laughs> it jumps. 
I didn't know you could jump. Oh, gross. It's like a mushroom that you can... Oh, gosh. Go away. Go away. Gosh. Boing! Boing! Would you like to jump? Oh, 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 uh oh. Ow. Major uh, 15%. Well, nobody else has made it this far, apparently. There's no dead sign here. Cool, I'm good. But, um, probably should save that for something else. The boss fight at the end is pretty intense. Um, but, yeah, the mod's pretty neat. Um, it's just the demo, but, you know, able to be played. Stop shooting head crabs! It's gross! And it was neat, and I, I, I thought it was a lot scarier than the uh, actual game, just some of the ideas. Which is which is something else that I really like about Half-Life, is that the because of the restrictions within the engine, they weren't able to show you exactly but they weren't able to show you exactly what they wanted. Um, which so they had to really work at giving you an atmosphere and giving you... Um, oh gosh. Like a spider. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Um, but it was really, it, they were using your, your mind really as a tool. Not only their engine. <laughs> Okay, I guess I have to go here. Oh, there was stuff up there, I think. Gosh. Well, uh, that's the end of this episode. Oh gosh. Um, if you'd like to see me, more of me, uh, Safe in here. Okay. Okay, I remembered this part. All right. <clears throat> I think that six dead scientists. If you'd like to see more of me dying and more of, <laughs> um, talking statue. Anyway, ignore that in the corner. Uh. If you'd like to see more, please like and subscribe. Um, I'm excited. We're almost done with this game, so if you'd like to see the ending, let me know. If you'd like to see, uh, if you'd like to tell me what to do next, let me know. Um, I am totally open to suggestions because I have no idea what I'm going to be doing next. So um, just let me know. And uh, if you don't like, if you didn't like the video, please like for the creepy blue water. I mean, this stuff is cool. <laughs> Thank you very much. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.